I am on the way to meet up Bill, Zach, and Shannon. We are going to Germany. Berlin first, Munich second. Bill and Zach's got a meeting with Reddick. Shannon and I will be looking for office spaces and trying to scope out what's a good place for us to see if there's a good place to open an office out there. walking to a security check-in. Hopefully, none of us get stopped. I, I don't know how Aria does this. My arm is tired. All right, so just boarded. buddy who met us here not a buddy but he now is our buddy we saw some really nice options really reasonable prices apparently they yes. like to encourage it looks new like companies in germany the city. is cheaper than sacramento yeah it's cheaper so uh, so yeah, yeah we saw some good options and he's going to take a look for us and then we're going to go on a little tour on uh free tog <laughs> to I don't know what that is. Fry, fry tog. Uh, I mispronounced it, but on Friday, and then we will uh, check them out. After Friday, we're going to be going to Munich, Munich no. to do a six the hour, same. Six-hour train. Yeah. So. Uh, so we're just going to keep walking through the park and taking in the sights. a six hour train ride. How was it? It's good. So good. We're uh, going to our uh, Airbnb pretty soon. Rest up, do a little bit more work tonight and uh, hopefully have a good Munich wrestle. That's what I'm most excited for. Yeah. What about I'm you guys? Hoping, I'm hoping that Munich is awesome because I heard good things about it and, yeah. I, and I want it to be awesome. So we'll see. Yeah. yeah. Here's going to be some more B-roll because yeah. Wow, what a good ending, Joe. Because, yeah. Pretzels! I got a regular They're size. How is it? Eh. I'm disappointed. Let's go. Not good. <laughs> Girl. 
Girl Schnatter. Girl Schnatter. The greatest sparkling water in the world. Here's this house that's literally splitting in half. I think it's not gonna make it till the end of the year. <laughs> Alright. Please include that in the vlog. <laughs> Alright, so we're uh, spending a day in Munich. It's Sunday. Nothing's open. Shannon decided to take a walk in the rain. Turns out her bomber jacket's not waterproof. Well, neither is her face. Got rained on, but we're gonna go find a bakery and just stuff our entire bodies full of pastries because there's not much we can do today because everything is literally closed. It's literally everything. Everything. Except for Starbucks. Well, that's a different place. Yeah. Is that it? No. That's not it. Here we see two engineers no, trying to it. navigate to a bakery. Why it's been five minutes sure now, because and it's they're still half miles away. We're going to a freaking bakery two and a half miles away. Yes. Also, the place you this found got a It's probably eight. close. You want to go there? I bet you it's close. Four minute walk. Most places are closed right now. Saying either there. Here you see two engineers fight over directions and information. Let's observe. What do you want? I want something close. Holy shit, man. That's all going in the vlog, by the way. How do we, how do, we do this? You have a, to, a solution why still not been reached. Don't know what it's been all right, here, minutes Shannon. now. All right, let's go, guys. Tried to do the whole Casey Neistat walk away from the camera thing. Too scary. It's starting to rain and uh, we wanted to go to the planetarium but uh, what happened? Uh, it's close. <laughs> Just our luck. All right, time to get out of the rain. Oh look who came with us, met us in Germany. Hi. So, Noel and I are getting ready for the meeting with Reddy. Uh, which is in one of their factories in Krakow, which hopefully will soon be producing our collectors very uh, quickly and cheaply. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to be able to do a lot of filming there most likely since it's mostly uh, um, stuff that they don't like you showing people. But um, yeah, that's our plan. So I'm in the middle of editing this vlog, and this happens. The United States will withdraw from the Paris Climate Accord. I think it's a pretty good idea we have a little talk about this. There are a handful of goals agreed to in the Paris Agreement by nearly 175 countries. That's almost all of them, by the way. But the major ones are as follows. Limit global average temperature increase to 2 degrees Celsius. Wealthy countries agreed to provide a $100 billion floor as a starting point by 2020. Set a course to ensure developed countries share the burdens of climate change on more vulnerable countries. The climate agreement is currently non-binding with no enforcement mechanism. Its goal isn't to reverse climate change in one fell swoop, but to provide a reasonable starting point to unite the world in a common direction to protect future generations. The United States is one of the biggest contributors to global warming. Without our commitment, the two degrees Celsius cap is essentially unachievable. Not to mention pulling out will be devastating to our economy, as renewable energy is one of the fastest growing sectors. The rest of the world will be moving away from fossil fuels. How will we compete? Well, we won't. 
Trump just created an environment ripe for China and the EU to poach our most skilled and innovative scientists, engineers, and entrepreneurs, as their financial commitments will allow them to make enticing offers to individuals and businesses working on challenges related to climate change. We'll get into more detail about how renewables ties into the economy in the coming weeks. But that's my rant for this week. All right, now that we're through that, back to the vlog. All right, so we're going to lunch and uh, we're at Marianne Platz. I'd vlog more, but I'm tired and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to bleep that out because... You're just failing too hard now, just give up. I know. I know this is gonna be able to be put in the vlog.